Hey everyone, it's Tina Marie. Welcome back to my channel. I've teamed up with Irresistible Meat to review their Sapphire Curling Wand. This curler has eight different barrel attachments in different shapes and sizes. So if you want tight spirals or loose waves, you can definitely get that look with any of the eight barrel options. And here are just a few other perks about the Sapphire Curling Wand. I love that it comes with its own bag and that helps with super easy storage. So I just wanted to show you guys a close up of the barrel, exactly what it looked like and what part is going to be attached to the other part of the curler. So once you plug in your curling wand, once you try to turn it on, it will give you this error message because the other part is not attached. So it's really easy. All you do is attach it and then you twist it to lock it in. You can set it to whatever temperature that you like. I did 430 because that's just what popped up immediately for me. And I'm just going to show you guys exactly what kind of curls I got with each different barrel. All right, so now it's time for styling. I really didn't know what I wanted to do at first, but once I started playing with my hair, an idea came to mind to do this really cute, simple style. So now I'm just parting my hair. I'm kind of parting it in like a triangle shape, and then I'm just putting the sides away until I get that taken care of later. And I'm just going to put this middle part into a ponytail.
So I'm putting the ends of my braids into a bantu knot because I honestly didn't even know what I wanted to do with them. So I'm just putting them aside for right now. All right, so I'm just putting the wand at the base of my hair and just wrapping my hair around it. I hold it for about 10 seconds and then I hold my curl in place and then I let it go. And here's just a look of my hair halfway done. Now you don't have to have your heat setting that high. It has many different temperatures that you can choose from. So I actually decided just to leave my little braided bantu knots on the side. I didn't know what to do with them. And if I would have took the bantu knot out, I just would have pinned the rest of my hair like behind my ear or something. This is different. So I just decided to keep it there. But that's basically it guys. I'm absolutely loving how my curls turn out. I love the variety that this wand has. So if you would like to get this wand, I'll leave all the information about it down below in the description box. Let me know what you guys think and I will see you all on the next video.